Ahoy, fellow adventurers and seekers of the Grand Line. Are you ready to dive into a tale of intrigue, sacrifice and revelations that could shake the very foundations of the One Piece world? Well, look no further, because today we're setting sail into the heart of One Piece Chapter 1099. In this thrilling video, we're not just recounting the latest exploits from Eiichiro Oda's masterpiece. We're unpacking the secrets, analyzing the alliances, and predicting the storms ahead. Will Kuma's sacrifice alter the course of the new world? What clandestine plots are brewing behind the closed doors of the world government? Join us as we break down the pivotal moments, dissect the artistry that brings these scenes to life, and explore how Chapter 1099 could foreshadow the future twists in this epic saga. Whether you're a seasoned pirate of the One Piece seas, or a curious newcomer caught by the siren's song, this video is your treasure map to understanding the depths of Oda's latest work. So grab your hats, ready your ships, and press that play button. Let's embark on this journey together and discover why One Piece continues to be the adventure of a lifetime. The tale begins now. If you like our content, feel free to like, comment, and subscribe below. Let us know what your thoughts on this chapter are and where you think the story will head going forward. With all of that out of the way, let's move on to the actual meat of this video. Summary of Chapter Events Chapter 1099 of One Piece opens with the dramatic resurgence of King Bikori, a figure whose past has been as obscured as the foggy shores of the Grand Line. His return is laden with political machinations. He appears flanked by the formidable might of marine forces, lending weight to his claim to the throne of the Sorbet Kingdom. This is no simple tale of a ruler reclaiming his throne. It is a chess move orchestrated by the world government itself, positioning a puppet to dance to their tune. The legitimacy of his rule is but a façade, a stark commentary on the nature of power and influence that resonates with real-world political scenarios. Amidst this backdrop of political posturing stands Kuma, a colossus of a man whose very presence defies the imposing marine escort. With a resolve as unwavering as the ancient stones, Kuma dismantles Bekari's forces single-handedly. His actions are not those of brute force alone, but carry a silent protest against the strings of the puppeteers above. As the dust settles, Kuma's title as king is secured, not by birthright, not by desire, but by necessity, a protector's mantle that he assumes while the true governance of the country remains in the hands of another. This chapter also casts a poignant light on Bonnie, a character whose fate is marred by accidental tragedy. Her consumption of the Toshi Toshi no Mi, the age, age fruit, is revealed to be a cruel twist of fate, bringing with it the curse of the sapphire scale disease. Her struggle is a human one, set against the fantastical elements of the One Piece universe, and her plight grounds the narrative with a somber note of urgency. The gravity of Bonnie's condition is the catalyst for Kuma's heart-wrenching decision to become the first pacifista. In an act of self-sacrifice that transcends the physical transformation he undergoes, Kuma offers himself to Dr. Vegapunk's project a gamble for a chance at Bonnie's cure. This decision is a testament to the depth of his character, revealing a layer of complexity and nobility that underscores the moral quandaries presented in the series. Amidst the unfolding drama, the chapter introduces a subtle but significant thread of intrigue. J. Garcia Saturn, whose silent observation of the events hints at a deeper play at work. His eavesdropping is not a mere footnote, but a foreshadowing of espionage that may well dictate the course of future chapters. Saturn's role, though shrouded in mystery, suggests a nexus of information and strategy that could pivot the storyline in unexpected directions. 
Thus, chapter 1099 weaves a dense tapestry of individual fates against the grand backdrop of one piece, with each thread tugging at the fabric of the overarching narrative in its own compelling way. Review of chapter in detail. Chapter 1099 is a testament to Eiichiro Oda's masterful storytelling, where political intrigue and personal sacrifice blend seamlessly to elevate one piece beyond the confines of genre. Oda's narrative technique is meticulous, with each plot twist and character revelation feeling both surprising and inevitable, a narrative sleight of hand that few can achieve with such consistency. The pacing is deliberate, allowing readers to dwell on the gravity of each scene, while the dialogue cuts with precision, revealing character motivations and driving the plot forward. In this chapter, the layers of Kuma and Bonnie are peeled back to reveal the beating heart of their intertwined destinies. Kuma, once an enigma wrapped in the guise of a tyrant, is humanized through his selfless acts, highlighting Oda's ability to transform characters from plot devices into beings with soul-stirring depth. Bonnie's portrayal as a resilient yet vulnerable figure facing an unjust fate serves to deepen her character, evoking a sense of empathy that resonates with readers. Oda's artistry in this chapter is as emotive as it is kinetic. The lines are drawn with a dynamism that captures the chaotic energy of battle and the subtlest nuances of despair. The art style effectively mirrors the chapter's toner, from the tense standoffs to the quiet moments of introspection, proving once more that Oda's visuals are an integral part of One Piece's narrative power. The emotional impact of the chapter is profound, culminating in the climactic decision of Kuma to sacrifice his freedom for Bonnie's life. This moment stands as a poignant reminder of the themes of sacrifice and loyalty that run deep in the series' veins. The climax, both heart-rending and hopeful, leaves the reader in a state of reflective anticipation for the ramifications it will have on the series. Standout moments, such as the revelation of Kuma's voluntary transformation into a pacifista, and the silent machinations of Jai Garcia Saturn are skillfully executed, ensuring that this chapter will be remembered as one where One Piece once again raised the bar for storytelling excellence in manga. Analysis of Chapter in Context Chapter 1099 of One Piece is a masterclass in thematic continuity, weaving long-standing series motifs such as the abuse of power, the will to resist, and the complex nature of justice into the current narrative. Oda's ability to maintain these themes throughout the epic saga while introducing fresh perspectives is nothing short of remarkable. The chapter's events tie back to the very core of One Piece, reminding readers that the journey of the Straw Hats is not just one of adventure, but also a battle against the oppression embodied by the world government the arcs of Kuma and Bonnie receive profound development, further anchoring them to the main story. Kuma's transformation from a feared warlord to a tragic hero aligns with Oda's penchant for grey character portrayals, challenging readers to question their initial perceptions. Bonnie's arc, revealing her lineage and her struggle with a unique disease, adds layers to the already complex political landscape of One Piece, suggesting that the ramifications of one's heritage can be both a curse and a catalyst for change. Political intrigue reaches new heights as Chapter 1099 sheds light on the world government's machinations. By backing King Bakori, the government's manipulation of power dynamics comes to the forefront, setting the stage for future conflicts that could involve the revolutionary army and the Straw Hat Pirates. This move adds a layer of urgency to the overarching rebellion against the Celestial Order, reinforcing the narrative's call for freedom against authoritarian control. Mythology and world-building are enriched with the introduction of the Pacifista Project and the mysterious Sapphire Scale disease. 
These elements expand the lore of One Piece, providing insights into Vegapunk's scientific endeavors and the biological oddities of the One Piece universe. The inclusion of these details not only serves to progress the plot, but also to deepen the world in which these characters reside, ensuring that the setting remains as engaging as the cast. Predictions for future events are rife with potential. The involvement of Jigarcia Saturn hints at new alliances and betrayals. Kuma's role as a pacifista could lead to a confrontation with the Straw Hats or play a part in a larger uprising against the world government. The secretive nature of Bonnie's cure may unravel new threads about the Celestial Dragons and their historical secrets. This chapter sets a precedent for future storytelling, promising a continuation of the series' intricate plotting, robust character development, and a narrative that never shies away from the complexities of a world rife with power struggles and the pursuit of freedom. Conclusion and Closing Thoughts Chapter 1099 of One Piece is a stirring symphony of Oda's storytelling prowess, showcasing his signature blend of action, emotion, and world-building. The chapter weaves critical threads of the overarching narrative into a tapestry that highlights the nuanced development of Kuma and Bonnie, while also painting the larger picture of political intrigue and the fight for autonomy within the One Piece universe. The artistry and emotional depth in this installment are indicative of why the series continues to resonate deeply with fans. The chapter stands as a beacon of the manga's enduring quality, with its ability to keep the audience anchored to the story while sailing into uncharted waters. As we close the cover on this chapter, the horizon brims with promise. The seeds sown here are set to bear fruit in the chapters to come promising upheavals and revelations that will further shape the destiny of the Straw Hat Pirates and the world they inhabit. We truly hope that you have enjoyed this review of Chapter 1099 of One Piece, and we would like to humbly thank you for watching all the way until the end. If you have enjoyed this video, please feel free to leave a like, comment and subscribe so you never miss another of our exciting uploads and make sure to hit the bell too, so YouTube doesn't forget to notify you of our next exciting upload. Thanks again, and have an amazing rest of your day. Keep the wind at your backs, and may all your dreams come true, pirate friends. Until next time, goodbye.